Hi viewers, welcome to our channel RJS Info. This video is about how to prepare accounts receivable in Excel and what are the steps to be followed before processing in Excel. What is accounts receivable? In simple term, it is a D from customer. It means it is outstanding amount from data. What are the steps to be followed? First thing is invoice raised for goods or services rendered. Next step will be account record the invoices with respective customer account. It means if any company has multiple subsidiary company or departments, the invoice should reach to specific to the department or subsidiary company. Then only we can be able to collect amount properly. Third step will be a reconcile or match quantity or price with purchase order or delivery chalan. Based on that only we have to raise invoice. If any discrepancy in delivery of goods or services then that has to be adjusted by debit note or credit note and account it properly. Then fifth step will be a collect amount based on invoices and it has to be mentioned in every accounting entry as per contract terms and conditions. Preparation of detailed list of fully paid invoices Reconcile company invoices with customer payment statement for entire year so that if any mistake from our side or their side, we can discuss and resolve it. And ninth step will be communicate monthly customer due and communicate to customer with due date for finding out any outstanding. Before preparation of invoices, there must be some agreement. Based on agreement, we have to raise invoices and number of credit days, mode of payment and what are the company details, everything should be mentioned in agreement. Then whenever goods are delivered, immediately you have to raise invoices and it has to reach timely delivery of invoices also. Then only we can able to collect amount. Close contact with officials for collection and timely reminder. Last step is whenever accounting is happening, it must have invoice number and customer details for easy reconciliation. This is the basic idea before processing accounts receivable in Excel. Accounts receivable statement should be very simple and easy to understand. There should not be any complex formulas because we are going to interact with customer. So the statement should be simple and neat. First it should start with uh, only the relevant information to the customer. Invoice number, invoice date, customer ID which we have created. First four digits should be a or four digits or five digits should be relevant to the company and last two digits can be a subsidiary company or department. It depends on requirement. After that company name and address. Then who is responsible person? We should know based on that only we can able to send the statement to them. After that invoice amount then due date simple formula 30 days from the invoice date then payment details. Whatever payment we have got 
from the customer that should be entered check number dated bank if any breakup is given for invoices that should be entered invoice detail this is very must based on that only we can able to calculate pending amount then payment date then how much we got it from customer then due invoice wise due then if there is a pending amount then delay here the formula is very simple for getting amount on invoices used we look up a2 then given range then invoice amount then exact after that used sum if sum if you are like a based on invoice number getting the all details of payment then it subtracted for delay very simple formula if l2 is greater than 0 then today's date minus g2 this is general statement before sending to customer make sure that just add some company name date and period while sending statement there should be a time stamp so cut off time should be very important after this time check may be coming so that should be considered later so time stamp is very important if you like this video please share it comment it please do subscribe for upcoming videos thank you